as you get older, you tend to care about things you didn't care about as a young male. So there are ways to get substances into the body efficiently, right? Injecting, obviously going past the dermal layer, is going to be the most effective. Intranasal is extremely effective. After intranasal, intrarectal, the membranes in the rectum absorb things very efficiently. But then you get into transdermal, topical, through your skin is a very efficient way to absorb things. But the problem is we put these things on our body that your body can absorb, that can disrupt. That's right, they can disrupt. Endocrinolog endocrinologically, I can never pronounce that right. I can read it. So endocrine disruptors, let's go with that. Your skin absorbs what you put on it. If you won't ingest it, you shouldn't rub it on your largest organ daily because we already expressed why the skin, the dermal layer is a tremendous drug delivery. Like think about testosterone cream, testosterone patch. Dudes with low test are delivered tests through their skin. So you're gonna deliver this crap through your skin that's gonna lower your test? Hell no. Beef tallow avoids every single one of these hormone disrupting compounds. No synthetic, no artificial fragrances, no chemical emulsifiers, nothing that suppresses testosterone. If you train hard, even if you train just a little, or even if you just don't care and you don't want to mess up your testosterone, you want to have really good skin, you want a product that supports rather than disrupts your biology. Beef tallow as found in mother folk care, tallow and honey balm is what you want to look for.